Would you like to know how Warren Buffett made $7.5 million in less than five minutes? Would you like to know how you can do the exact same trade? In this video, I show you how he did it, why he did it, and how you can do it too. When you think about Warren Buffett, probably the first thing that comes to your mind is a very intelligent, successful investor that buys stocks and companies and owns them for a very long time. And that's a big part of his investing success. However, it isn't the only reason why he's such a profitable and successful investor. Another reason is because he has pocketed billions of dollars by selling put options. In fact, in one annual report, Buffett acknowledged that Berkshire Hathaway collected premiums by selling 94 put option contracts. Selling put options is just one of the types of derivatives that Buffett trades in, and it's one that you might want to consider as well. Here's an example of how Buffett does it. In the spring of 1993, Buffett sold $50,000, $35 put option contracts in Coca-Cola. Those options expired later that year in December. For selling those options, he was paid $1.50 per share or $7.5 million. At that time, Coca-Cola was trading at $39 per share. By selling those put options, he pocketed $7.5 million up front. It was his money to keep regardless of what happened. As long as Coca-Cola stayed above that strike price of the put option he sold, which was $35 by expiration day, he would never have to buy the stock. If, however, Coca-Cola dropped below that $35 per share, Buffett would simply buy Coke at $35 or the strike price of the put option that he sold. There are two very important things to note that Buffett did here. First, Buffett was making a very intelligent bet that a world-renowned, extremely profitable and successful company, Coca-Cola, it wasn't going to fall in price by very much. Second, if Coca-Cola did fall below $35 per share, Buffett would have the option of buying that business at a cheap price. If you know him, you know that he likes to buy awesome companies at cheap prices. I do also, and I feel pretty safe in saying that you do as well. These are some of the same reasons why I love selling put options so much. Those options pay me up front for being bullish or neutral on awesome companies. And if I'm wrong, I'm punished by having to buy those companies at a cheaper price than they were selling for when I sold those options. Coca-Cola is one of the companies that Buffett is well known for buying at a cheap price many years ago. But that $7.5 million was by no means Buffett's largest option trade. There's also the time when he pocketed almost $5 billion in a single year by selling put options. He discusses in his 2008 letter to shareholders. During the time, volatility was near its peak. Buffett took advantage of it and was paid $4.9 billion for selling put options in the broad market indexes. He said that he was betting that they wouldn't fall much farther. And you know what? He was right. Although they did fall, and some of those options were showing losses for periods of time, looking back now, it was a very intelligent trade for him. Now you might be thinking, this is Warren Buffett we're talking about here. This guy is one of the richest people on the planet Earth. I can't do trades like that. But in reality, you can do trades exactly like that. Okay, maybe you'll need to drop a few zeros off the number of contracts that you sell, but you can do the exact same trade that he did. And as a result, you can profit in the exact same way by selling put options, just like Buffett has been doing for many years. And you too can receive the same punishment if you're wrong. That being able to pocket nice cash up front while buying companies that you like at a discount. Have you ever heard the saying, heads I win, tails I win? To me, that saying best describes what we do here on this channel. We know that no matter what happens, ultimately, we win. Yes, we may have some awesome positions that move against us, just like Buffett did, but ultimately, we win either way. Let's dig a little deeper into Buffett's last trade that I mentioned, where he pocketed $4.9 billion so we can understand why and how he did this trade. One of the ways that the Oracle of Omaha shares his knowledge is through Berkshire Hathaway's annual letters to shareholders. In his 2008 letter, he discusses his option positions and the value of those options, how much they were up or down on those positions during the previous year. We can gain a lot of wisdom by understanding how he planned to profit by selling those options. In that letter, Buffett said, I believe each contract we own was mispriced at inception, sometimes dramatically so. What did he mean by that? And how can we do that? Buffett was saying that the put options he sold was an investment because he expected to profit from them. He was saying that just like we do in our channel and in my Patreon group, he viewed option selling as a tool for investing. When he believed he was getting paid sufficient or possibly even an excessive return for selling a put option, he believed that was an investment opportunity that he was going to take advantage of. He then pointed out that in his opinion, sometimes options sold for more than they should have sold for. He said that he believed the option pricing model, which is a fancy way of saying how options are priced, he said that model is flawed. It becomes even more and more flawed the farther out in time the option is to expiration. Because of this perceived investment opportunity, in his letter, he explained that their put option contracts totaled $37.1 billion 
at the current exchange rates and were spread among four major indexes, including the SP 500 in the US and the major indexes in the UK, Europe, and Japan. The first contract came due on September 9th of 2019 and the last one on January 24th of 2028. In total, he received option premium in the amount of $4.9 billion. He then mentioned that this money, it had already been invested. You see, like Buffett, we too take some of the money that we receive by selling options every single month and buy a little piece of companies outright. In fact, we take 10% of that as you can see here. Here are the companies that we bought 10% of with the option premiums that we received from last month. This helps us understand another technique that Warren Buffett likes to use. No doubt you're aware that he loves insurance companies. Insurance companies are paid policy premiums up front by their customers that they can invest while they wait for the time when they have to pay out claims against those policies. In the insurance world, that money that the insurance company receives up front is called float. In the options trading world, it's called option premium. In this trade, the options that Warren Buffett wrote or sold were European style options. That means that they could not be exercised until expiration. So he didn't have to worry about paying out the value of those options before expiration. A brilliant move by a brilliant investor. In fact, one of the wisest investors of all time in my opinion. As a result, he pocketed $4.9 billion in option premium. Shortly thereafter, the position actually moved against him. He was showing a loss of $5.1 billion. But as he mentioned, it's only the price on the final day that counts. By the way, if that was really useful, what I just share with you, I'd love it if you just give this video a like, just bump the like button. And while you're down there, go ahead and hit the subscribe and bell notification. So how can you and I do trades similar to the ones that Buffett does? Let me show you how. Notice that Buffett sold 15 to 20 year expiration put option contracts. Now you and I, we can't do that. However, there are several things that we can do that Buffett can't do. Because he's trading with such large numbers, he can't just go out and sell options in the open market. You and I, well, we can. In fact, we don't even have to trade in large indexes. We can trade in individual stocks that we believe are underpriced or are paying a great option premium on the put options that we want to sell. This is one reason why we prefer selling put options in companies that have recently experienced a price decline that are beginning to level off and find support. We also make sure that we're selling put options at strike prices that we'd be happy to own the stock at. If the stock is assigned to us, we're happy to own it. We just turn them into a covered call position if it's in our main option trading account. However, if the put options are not assigned to us, then we either roll the option out or put that capital to work in a brand new opportunity. One opportunity that comes around four times a year where we see many potential option trades is during earnings season. You see, during earnings season, there's going to be a lot of volatility. Some great companies are going to say something during their earnings report that the market just doesn't like. And as a result, they're going to experience a dramatic drop in price. When that happens, as those stock prices are beginning to level off, we plan to take advantage of those opportunities and sell put options in those companies. Now, we don't sell put options in just any company. In fact, we have a hand-picked list of approximately 200 companies that we've researched and feel comfortable selling put options in them, just like Buffett does. Also, just like Buffett, our goal is to sell put options in quality companies and receive the benefit from that cash flow to buy solid companies at a discount or to grow our capital base. We then take some of that option premium or cash flow or in the insurance world to be called float. We take 10% of it and buy some of our favorite companies that we believe are trading at a discount or that we want to own for the long term. We buy them outright with that option premium. You see, Buffett frequently uses options and other similar type of derivatives to slowly build his portfolio over time in great companies at prices that he's happy to own them at. While the majority of his strategy is to buy and hold, options allow for awesome gains, provide steady streams of income that he uses to buy his favorite companies or enable him to get paid to buy those companies at a discount. We do the exact same thing, just with a few less zeros. If you'd like to come along with us and trade options the way that Warren Buffett does, the way that we do every single month, check out the benefits of becoming a patron down at the link in the description below. The thing about successfully trading in stocks and options is that you must know when is the right time to enter a position. To help you do that, at the video in the link above, I share three tips on how I pick the companies that I sell put options in and when I do that. Please check that video out. I think you'll find it very helpful. Until next time, happy investing, and we'll see you again soon.